Hey y'all, happy Monday. Welcome to another vlog. So listen, check it. We dipped out for the weekend and headed up to New York. It was time to check in and connect with family and friends. Hadn't seen them in person since August of last year. For shame, for shame on us, on our part. But anyway, we up here for the weekend. So hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thanks for hanging with me. And um, just see what kind of adventures we had while in New York visiting our people. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Cause everyone keep looking like you. I can't take no more. I miss your touch from your hands and your body. It hurts so much to think of you as someone else. Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me. Now I'm talking sweet all by myself. Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me. Put your need from me. What's up, y'all? We are in Brooklyn right now and headed to Manhattan. What's going on, people? All right, so I am in Zara right now. Y'all don't pay my hair no mind. It'll win, y'all to my little, little bit of curls that I did have. And, and they don't look good. <laughs> I'll get it together later on. get my eyebrows threaded or cleaned up because y'all see I don't have a lot of eyebrows so I'm gonna get them cleaned up uh, I am right now I'm in Harlem so I went to Raj eyebrow spa and they did a really good job just shaped them up because y'all know I don't really have thick eyebrows anyway. I'm thinking about getting them um, um, microbladed because that'll give me a little bit more volume to my brows and a little darker color. So I was walking to meet him and stopped and found a little wine spot. How cute it is in here. Get ready for a Portuguese. This is a sparkling. Yeah, yeah. Right there, but if you want to drink it in the near future, this is really good. Yeah. The sparkling comes from as well. This is going to be a blend of Baga and Tariga Nacional. Baga is really a specialty of this region. Take your time, we're in a rush. Uh, Tariga Nacional grown all over Portugal. Tariga is going to add some nice sort of floral structure to the wine. Baga is often compared to Nebbiolo, and you can definitely, I think, see that comparison. This is their very entry-level red wine, the producer, and it's kind of like their Long uh, Nebbiolo, Long Rosso equivalent. Uh, the big, big difference, Nebbiolo, very high alcohol these days, often like 14% alcohol at least. This is 12 and a half. So, much fresher, much brighter, and you can drink half a bottle and you'll be okay. It's like, remind me of Jasmine. Yeah, yeah, definitely a lot of that sort of purple, yeah. uh, green sort of notes. Uh, there's a lot of wild herbs that just grow in Virata. But also when you have red varieties and you're mm -hmm. working at slightly lower alcohol levels, you are almost always going to get some of that sort of purple tone. This is nice. Another adventure. The first coffee. 
State. They have these items. They have a lot of stuff in here, but this stuff is so pretty. The dress. I really like this top. So there is no way we will get through this entire mall today. This mall is humongous. Go shop. <laughs> I know I can't stand when people be like you instead of human. People be like, that was so humorous. No, it was humorous. But the mall is nice and I like it because they have like a um, QR code that you can scan to find your way around the mall to the different stores. So now I'm looking for him. Somebody sprayed way too much cologne. Yeah, me. Gee whiz. Ooh, that is strong. <coughs> I can't breathe. But he should be around here somewhere. Oh no, it's a perfume counter in the middle of the mall. So it looks like they have like their own little atomizers or little oil droppers. And you can create your own fragrance. Thank you. Okay, so it was a place where you, they have their own oils, Arabian oils. And I have on, she put pink rose on me. Oh my God, it smells so good. And you just choose your size. So you don't mix the oils up. You just choose the size oil that you want. And um, they had so many different fragrances. Um, one of them smells just like Baccarat. I think it was called Arabian Gold. I, it's three. <laughs> God, they smell so good. All of them. I don't know. I'm going to get one of them, though. I think. I don't know. I might be starting to not care for this rose too much. In my, if, I think that would do good in your bath water more so than like me wearing it or a, like a night fragrance. Yeah. I think that could be... be oh, sorry. So I think that would be a really good night fragrance. It's so colorful in here. Y'all know how much I love color. Ooh, do I want to get the juice? No, I'm actually hungry. So, one thing for sure, two things for certain. I'm getting my steps in. Mm -hmm. So y'all, I'm in Mr. Beast's restaurant.
y'all so it is saturday evening at 9 23 getting ready to have a little family and friends jump off at um one of my husband's closest friend's house that's where i am right now um they all went to the store to pick up liquor and pick up some wine and pick up food um i know we're having some deviled eggs and we're also gonna have some my sister-in-law's come on her way over here she's gonna make some empanadas um they're gonna pick up some pizzas and wings just gonna you know have a little vibe session um i'm tired so i've been struggling to stay awake but i'm here by myself so it's kind of quiet right now i was on sensory overload for a minute because y'all know my house is normally quiet because unless it's like the tv on or or the radio but girl they had the tv on well the tv is on now it's on the baseball game but basketball was on earlier the radio was going it was a lot so i was like i felt like Celie on color Pur color purple when she was sitting there watching mr G get ready for sugar to come that's how i've been feeling <laughs> with all this going on around me so um and it's crazy because i don't typically experience sensory overload but it also might be because i was in that mall it was loud it was a lot going on in there then the music in the car was loud and whew, yeah i think i need a um a, a, a moment of hush oh i gotta take this call i'll be back hey y'all we are at milk and honey in brooklyn and it is a cute restaurant we get ready to order our brunch so you come in and you get in line you order your food and then you choose your seat so i'm excited to try it And then they be sitting there talking about like Hey y'all, uh, happy Sunday. I am in um Happy Court, Brooklyn and checking out all of the black owned wines and spirits that I can find in here and see what I'm gonna pick up for today. Y'all let's take a look. Yeah, I wanted to check on the price of that one. I know it's a toss up, oh, but I hate the fact that we lost such a the Uber pulling up on call. Tell me, is you trying to fall through? I'm a 